Hi, this is a TI-84 calculator running Wolfram Alpha, except that it's actually just a Raspberry Pi connected to a touchscreen in the shell of an old TI-84+. Plus. On the back, you can see I've got a battery connected via Velcro and a connection down into the Raspberry Pi. I'll go ahead and open it up now. I started by taking apart a broken TI-84 that I bought off eBay, and one of the first steps I did was dremeling off the screen off of it so that it's just this bare PCB with the buttons on the front but a gap for the screen to go in. The next step was cutting a hole in the battery compartment of the back of the TI-84 so that I could fit the wires through, and that would also allow me to fit the Raspberry Pi on the front here. I also cut out some scaffolding beneath the screen here so that the screen could actually fit in this space. Next, I drilled some holes through these four corners and a few in here so that I could mount both the Raspberry Pi and the screen on the back here just using some screws and some washers that go through the back. The Pi and the display are connected over this slim HDMI cable and the touchscreen inputs are registered through this USB-C to micro USB cable. For the Raspberry Pi, I installed the latest Raspberry Pi OS distribution and then I installed the touchscreen driver that was given on the website and I also made sure to change the rotation of the screen because the screen default outputs vertically like this. So I had to change it just like this in one of the config files. And then finally, I installed an on-screen keyboard library so that I could actually have inputs into the calculator because these face buttons don't actually work anymore. Some possible improvements. I think having this keypad emulate an actual keyboard would be really useful because entering inputs on the small screen on using the on-screen keyboard, it's basically impossible. And I didn't end up doing this because I don't really use this calculator. It's kind of just a cool project, fun idea. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching.